Blessings and give thanks. If you do really, you know, Brethren, listen to that voice. Yeah, if you know, voice, you know, if you yeah, hear that voice man. there, John, if you didn't have the voice there. Yeah, we we give that. thanks for the we moment. Uh, we are rich. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Every time, Bridget. It's a it's a overdue pleasure, Bridget. Good well, Lord. Rockwell, Sir Rockwell. It's a pleasure being here. A long time in a Rockwell. Bridget. John, let me tell you something. I last night I was thinking and my daughter is 27 now. It's about 23 for 24 years. Now. Because um for when I just came to South Florida, you know, you're one of the one way. I, I, um, I mean, earlier, early, I came early. to South Florida, um, 95. Yeah. I came 94, so I know. Yeah, man, See it them. was, yeah, man, as a young Rockwell, though. No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. God have mercy. Yeah, so yeah, 95, when I came, the first person that I really met in the music um, industry, really, I beat up Peter Pan, you know, because, right. yeah, because, yeah. The first band that I played it was um, United Force, you know, Jack. And I met some other people, but Peter Pan, from that moment until this moment, had become like a brother I, from another I, mother. And, and, and I still played South Florida. Peter, Peter has played for everybody and almost every artist that has, that has come through South Florida. At, one, at some point, at some enough. point in yeah. time, you know. Yeah, the great, great, great sprang, you see me? Yeah, my brother. Yeah, man. Yeah, no man. forever, yeah, man. you know. All right, so when I met you, I met you, I was introduced to you as um, a former studio one, though. Yeah. And, yeah. but it seemed as if Studio One was the school and you start work outside of Studio One. It's like after you built a name enough to start work. Yes. As a drummer, but not in Jamaica. Oh, uh, well, yeah, because you know what? For real, Raquel, because all in Jamaica really know me now, Raquel, about drums, you know. Most of the people really know me about some, discotheque because some, yeah. being, being the unruly kid, <laughs> Can't fish and good for this one. Can't fish and good for this yeah, one. Yeah, you know, how, how, how I grew up around music is like, um, I really, for really, not being a really kid, make me a yard talk right now. Because, you know? um, like, my mom, my parents was like, you know, I'm reggae, I see, you know, you feel me? Okay, okay, church. Yeah, church, you know. Seventh day Adventist? No, Our Church of God of Prophecy, oh, you know. Oh, God, oh, God. Yeah, Lord. and it's a little way. She not just tap the tap. Walk, she walk, 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 walk. And her people didn't walk, walk, oh, walk. Oh, you mean? <laughs> yeah, yeah, you can't skip it. So now, is, is that now, I was stolen from my home one Sunday morning <laughs> by a great privy clerk, you know? One Sunday morning, him come on the avenue. But him always see me as a youth, like 17, in you know, the street, and him would have said, I go, can you go give me some daddy you now? And one Sunday morning, I was a woman in company, and he called me. He said, You're coming to me this morning. And I said, But you know, you have to kick in there and roll the thing now. I said, Go on the street, I come, you know. Right. You go back in, and you know, you have to go around Mama till you get missing, you know. <laughs> yeah, you so, get busy till you don't know, don't know where you're You don't know where you're there. <laughs> I just got to see. So that day, and 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 presently, the first day at Studio One, uh, uh, with me need them and knock like my drumstick well, still. I always like to hear them, not just the background, but the background by the background. Who was Clement that to you at that time? How much did you know of I, Clement that, well, at that time? Well, that I'm telling you now, this first day when the jet take me out of the yard, you know, um, Privy Clark, the guitar player, 
All of them rhythm get tired from about six to nine come down here talk about the Dennis Brown, the whole of them talk through. Me, me really come up in a fertile reggae community, you know. Yeah, because I grew up where all these artists from Studio One used to come to the community because ah. uh, a friend of my here and Studio One went to, um, Soul Defenders went to, to, to Studio One with Freddie McKay and that brought um, Studio One artists to, to Linstead regular because now they were, um, the Soul Defenders band was like the house band okay. along okay. with a part of it like Bagawa kind of thing, right, you know? Right. So that the first day I went there is like being so little bit too. The sad dad figure said, I wouldn't bust and I'm drunk them still because I look like a you know? Yeah, so that's where I met Mr. Dad the first time. Who, on the first day. Who who was claiming that to you at that time? Did you know the no, power? I didn't, no, okay. no, I didn't know. Okay. Yes, I knew through music because my tell you, so we grew up in other fertile community. Right, right. You know? So you knew him as the producer? Yeah, man, okay. yeah, man, right. as the tough still the one. Right. Because what really taught me to play drums, you know? Is me and my little friend them we never go back to school and uh, we we'll buy a record and we we'll go lock up in other house and, practice. and we me listen all the drum me I learn to play the drums by list, learning to play the beat of the song while my little friend he might learn to play the bass wow. by learning to play the bass line of the song right so right. I saw we and we not come out of the top ten. So, so we end up with a pile of records. So, and a yeah. pile of songs that you know too. Well, yeah. You know what I say? So, was it what? Because Dad brought a lot of R&B and soul music to Jamaica. Were you know, learning the soul and, and R&B songs? No, so just all right. Songs. You know, it's when we grew older now, we start to, to realize that these songs were not original <laughs> I know songs. you want Bridget. <laughs> you see me? I when yeah. I grew up older, we right. are finding No Man Is An Island. Right. Most of, uh, a lot of Alton songs and all of that. Right, but right. Yeah, right. We're yeah. covers. Yeah, we're covers, you know. But the first day I went to Studio One is I, I met up into Jai White, but that time she was a Christian, you know, with the frog real on the song. <laughs> and that day, I, 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 I played a I, I did five songs that I could have brought home to my mother, you know, because it was five rats. Because them right, time, the dry right, white, right, she right. never do a dread out there. And them right, time, you know? right, right. Yeah. So, meeting the sad dad um, right now, the sad dad, hats off to the sad dad. Oh, no, hold on, hold on. So, so we have to get the inside. You did five songs. Yeah. What was the money for five songs? Was it was, oh, was this, at the were time, you earning money at this time? Or? Yeah, man, come here, earn money and go with it, and they not make nobody know. So <laughs> full of money on Friday. But man. because you know, we hear the stories of not only players of instruments, but 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 singers who in the all day. All right, it's to me, you know, I tell us a straight truth. It's to me, sad that. I respect him to the ground way more. And he said, I look at you. Yeah, all right. He say, where I reach right now, when I came back for my drums and I reflected my youth. Mm -hmm. I remember when me used to come home, when we got a student, we had no money for come home. I would go to Mr. Dad and he would give him money for come home. And watch now. When Mr. Dad did there on that Friday, you know, sometime, by the time he missed him, would I reach Miami. When, when, when we go for a pier Friday, you know, um, the mother deduct the money when we give it through the week. But then, if the man <laughs> no deduct the money then, we know that he do in business and all that we hungry so, right so, now. So, 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 so you are justified. You are justified. Oh, you, then, then, then you are pay away. <laughs> right. All right. At the time. So that means he must have told him what a whole thing he gave each other during the week. Have him all right. You know, Mr. <laughs> he, 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 he kind of have a little thing like, like they, you know, they, where the shopkeeper them keep with some wool if bill where you got your trust from him. Right, right, right. And tell us that man of that wool if people we are say that man rob him. He might be right. Nah, right defend that. He right you know, I'm I'm not nah say Mr. Dad is the perfect person. Right. But right. I think him get too much. You know what I say? I right. hear the next thing too. 
Oh, a man will teach me to fish. They mm. no fish me for go fish and respect it. Right, right. But listen, Mr. Dad, and he make me know the simplicity of music. Mm. How simple it is. Mm. Yeah, because me was a little Do you read music? No, I don't. But you see, hold on then. This is the amazing thing to me. And I know I know it's in every genre. I know R and B have those stories and soul have the stories. But I have to say that reggae music, as far as I am concerned, has the most talented non formally trained musicians that I know. Can't read music and yet still one of the baddest basses, baddest drummers. You know, you know what I mean? I right, lead right, the time. Right, they don't read them can't. if you put a sheet music in front of them, they don't have a clue. Ka, 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 you know, remember, you know, reggae, you know, a revolution, you know, a reggae. Remember, the average Jamaican never had no respect for reggae. Because they get yeah, where it come, come from. Yeah, so, yeah. reggae had a feeling, you know, and the way you read, you know, or you feel right. it within you, you know. But, that. but, but, John, a drummer can hear a, a rhythm, fill it with the drums, mm -hmm. and then the next show play it the same way. Let him play it the first time without sheet music. Yeah. And you're, and you're, listen, as an MC, I stand on the side and I, these are the things, because live music is, is my world. I love you. You know, say anything round town, if it's live music, it's show up even for those vibe out on it. Yeah. But I'm always amazed at how many musicians in the reggae industry can't read, but All are, right. are the, at the top All of right. the pile. I, I, if you remember this this interview with Mr. Dad and Ian Warren, mm -hmm. he spoke about the musicians that he liked to work with. Right. All right. He might tell about school of music, Alpha, mm -hmm. the military. Mm -hmm. But he might make you know, say, see the man off of the street. Yes. Because you know, they, they, you know, they train, they, 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 the Alpha, the JDF, these people are trained, they are. I don't want to say program, but they are they are theoretical people. Yes, yes. You see, yes. we are for the street. Yeah, a vibe. I all feel, a bro. Vibe, yeah, man. That, all right. <laughs> you see, even right now, into production, the, the the most important part of my production is not going up at studio one. It's important. It, it, it's important still, you know. But in other, it's not the, the most important part. Is not about being a drummer. You know when we really in my production when we really try to um, replicate the ten years when me not play drums, I may have play sound system because mm -hmm. that bring you in a more intimate um, space with the with the with the the, the, the dance world, the, the, the love of right, music. See? Right, right, so right here right. and then, it's for them ten years. Eh? Me understand. What 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 people relate to in that, terms of music? And that's a in. valid. That's a valid valid but, point. But, but you must also remember, it was musicians who, who 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 it was sound operators who put musicians to work. You talk about the same cocks in that. Right. You talk about do, right. do so that's, a, that's a good way of looking. That's how yeah yeah. So it it wasn't cause the musician you know, if not understand the people. Mm -hmm. He can be selfish, you know, because mm -hmm. more things of him thing are the best thing, you know. Mm -hmm. That that thing of him thing are the best thing. You see, when you become a, a, a sound system you, operator. You, and you have to move people. You know the pop. And you, and you know you what, know, what yes. Rudy, you know. I, I can't relate. You know like I don't you know, like shaving cream on them songs, you know. Because right. hardcore thing we grew up in. Right, know. right. Yeah, my mother grew up with. But, we love but, get up. but. But you know, sometimes. Me, I forgot about, like, we, we used to play, like, for uptown, downtown, underneath the time. Right, right. <laughs> right, right. So, we we'll play from Lions to round the corner where you know where I'm coming. Right, see? right. You see, sometime when we get a job now for Lions or JCs, up, yeah. or anywhere uptown, yeah. I have to buy back shaving cream, you yeah. know, you know, yes. you know what I'm saying? Yes. Give them people a nice time. I have to play yes. shaving cream tonight. Why is it not done? I don't know where shaving right. cream they are right. getting, you know. Right. So right. if I get right. another job. And you can't go down to it either. But, you know, but, but, and then, because we play mostly right. mid-town, downtown. Yeah. We don't really need shaving cream. Right, right. You know, right. but then anytime we get that job. You need a Jacob Miller though. Yeah, man, you need a, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you understand what you need a burning spirit. Right, yeah. right, right. That, in that, other words, sometimes 
when you go as you go to a venue sometimes you you can foresee what's going to happen hold on, tonight. Hold on, hold on. because that is a very unique perspective because players of instruments don't often play a sound system. That and very you know, rare sound system man that not is a you player know. of instrument. But you have both sides of it. Well, give thanks so. <laughs> not being under no musical country. Right, right, right. I do anything more and more. I really love sound system and they know So hold on now. Having something like Studio One on your resume. Most man would have wear that pan their hat and pan their shirt, but you left that to go play a sound system. What happened? And you what know, happened? I, I, wow, because it might be because of that little youth, you had to suck more yellow for that. And it don't mean nothing. Because we, we come home as my little friend and me and my little friend, them, and tonight we had a dance and them bad tune there. Them boy, I never knew what I missed. I'm a first hit tune that till I kiss you. Yeah? And it don't really come like nothing. And then because my day at home, Look like you had something wrong, you know what I mean? I say, was, was, was playing a sound system more acceptable to mom than no, than, than, not than, near reggae road, man. I hear you, I no, hear you. man. I so, hear you, yeah. So, for sometimes, my mom went out of the house, Alfred, uh, two weeks, she go down to see me. I was sleeping at the house every time, you know what I mean? I say, time you come yeah, in. but me come in later and she come out early, and me right. wake up later and right. gone, and you know what right. I say. So, but you were you were earning money. Yeah, and but well, did, did mom know you were early, earning money? No, nobody. Then you know what less then? No, but but you yeah, know <laughs> that's how that, that's how I made sound system with the money that I made. Yeah, but to moms at home now you never get a fight. You know what less if you are coming late at night and sleep late yeah, morning right, and not really the money. Oh, she used to call me. She used to introduce. <laughs> <laughs> all right, see, this she is used fine. Introduce right. me to her friends as this is my L O S T child. <laughs> Yeah, but make could fast forward, you know. Me and her in our last days, we had some beautiful time can watch. No, now. of course, because I love shit. I can't search, you can't search. No, but, but look now, but look now, the church now can't go on without reggae. Yeah. So watch me and mom now. We had a good time with it. Because now, me are here love. Yeah. I mean, I did a yard. I mean, I said, so I'm starting. You know, I apologize to me for all the problems that we have put me through. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we had a good time about it. Nice, you know what I said? Nice, yeah, nice. man, because I could understand it because the first thing which she never wants, you know, a Rasta and Ghana. Right. You know, you know what right, I said? Right. And you know, right. say reggae. Right, right, you right, right, right. But no, as a grown man, you understand the concern for your child. No, I knew all along, you know, okay. all along, you know. All but right. then the thing is, that I within me enough day me not the back of my head. I mean I see where them are going so far because me not see nothing wrong with music. Right. And, the, and the thing is, I've never played a piece of music behind my mom that I couldn't play. See, in front, and that's what I the, it was the stigma of reggae and yes. rasta. It had nothing to do I, but I, I, with I, the other songs there. I, because I, I, only for them songs. Oh I was here. brought up. Oh I was brought up. Nah man, I was brought up properly, man. So anything on my fault and certain certain fault, me not going to take, so me not going to do it. You right, know right, right, right. And right. the values, the morals that I grew up with, from where I look at you, that's why I tell you about Sharon Cream. And a song where me and my friend them play. Right, right. Yeah, we don't right. do them, them little things that we are talking about, are the more hard curve, the burning spear, the Dennis Brown, the, the life music, you know what right. I say? Yeah. Not yeah. the fantasy of music, we don't right. play that. Right. Right, yeah. right, right. Yeah, because this is how we grew up, and 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 me and my other friends that 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 we, that we started band playing music with, like um, Trevor Hilton and another you, um, Constantine Martin, Lennox Mitchell. Mm -hmm. Um, we it was like we're one and the same, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Values. Right. Yeah. Right, and we right. never lose that. Right. Yeah. Right. right. So it's not but even the mis misconception because boy the story the story is only the names change. I but, had I had um Casanova um in studio, uh lead singer for Fab Five. Yeah. Um um uh Friday I think it was or Thursday and he was telling the same thing. Mama come home here in a church and 
the struggle for her to accept. Yeah, Even man. though he wasn't singing any negative songs no. whatsoever, no, it was the it. fear of what reggae represented yeah, yeah, at yeah. that time. Yeah, yeah. It was just that. And all right, you know, I used to tell my mom, because we had a good time. Uh, man, <laughs> a lot of people would be in a still, you see me? Yeah. But me used to say, why you think say them come around me? Because uh, Nikki not think say oh you grew me make them come right, around me. Right. And she lived right. to see that that, that was it. I was never I'm going, I'm going fast forward to that, you know, because you are doing something <laughs> not a joke to that. You are doing something right now, Bretchy, that one, the seat I grow. Two, I knew this was your vision before before you pack up and went back to Jamaica. This is what you <laughs> went back to Jamaica to do. Yeah. I don't know if you I don't know if you thought that it would be as successful as it is, but I know you went down there with not my love in your heart. Yeah, no, I'll tell you something. It's a from a come back from my drums. And I'm not doubt about that. The only thing we're made sure about it would have taken me a very long time because all right, we grew up in the wood and all that era. And right, me, right. Me, 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 me own somewhere I shouldn't own right now. I never really come back from the drums. You hear what you say? As that when me play a song, me know my man know about my drums. And me, honestly, I tell you, say, because that at 18, 19, 20. What were you running from with that drums? Can you you didn't just stop playing drums. Listen, and the listen. sound system where me invest money. No, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I eat care of my man. Carry me away from my drums, man. But the love of sound system. And then uh, other thing, my friends that, that that kept me grounded around drums. Um, they left for the States. I mean, never really liked States from my youth. So them left me I play with the elder them alone. Mm -hmm. Cause me used to play right. with with my little youth them. I mean <clears> I play still the one with the elder them and them time they had to have about Earth Sunday album there on the road and then right. line my clean so my also used to go around with them right okay. yeah but I, I i i spend most of my days in the studio though yeah most of my, my drum life back then and you asked me about when like um the second time around i really foreign me go mexico and spend some time and shortly after that me come states so that's why a lot what are you me. doing in, in, in mexico uh, yeah mommy that work at cats I spent about five months of cats, four months of cats in a Cancun. That was all right. When I came back from my drums, mm -hmm. that was my first move, 1991. Mm -hmm. 1990, 1990. After the first song I wrote. But my whole well, other John, we're still at the point where I understand you falling more in love with sound system. But a bass, I always work with him bass. A box guitar man walked with him box guitar. Yeah. You left your drums. You never even carry your drums just to I say why sure. in a your room you can't just bounce. No, I you know what? My my confess to you again. It's a Glenn Washington now. A drummer? Bobolano. As I like you know when I make the transition from sound system to drums. From drums to sound system. I have my drums. But me need more money for buy more amplifier. <laughs> so we decide to say the disease, the, drums. the addiction. Oh, so is the addiction the, catch you? Yeah, but okay, decide, we but can't come buy my drums now. Them time they go in Washington and Christian I come from me up in now. Right. And them come at Linstead and them come buy my drums. And and you know, <laughs> when me meet Glenn now, the first time me meet Glenn up here, I was in a studio. And he came inside. Our our brethren studio, a woman's studio. No, it was it was on Pembroke Road. Okay. Like white man okay. studio. I don't All remember. Right. Dear me another studio on okay. Pembroke Road. I think a woman's studio may meet you in. Uh, could Mr. have been. Mr. Yeah. Gary Wong's so studio. that's where I met Glenn, and he came in the studio and he said to me, "Um, you remember? You remember me?" <laughs> me? I said, "No." He said, "No, my mama come by your drums." Me, me, and you me, come full circle, come back up, Glenn, don't yeah, yes, again. I mean, I say, no, me remember the, 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 the church people, but him personally. Right. I right. know, my we know really could have put him in a place. Right, you know right, what I mean? right, right. Yeah. But I, I left, I sold them the drums to buy an amplifier. Okay. To play a sound system. Okay. Yeah. But then, fast forward, what brought me back to drums? It was my brother, Jarrison Soul, you know. Him, 
he came to Jamaica. I didn't grow up around him. And when he came to Jamaica, he, was, he, he used to carry my sound system all over Jamaica, see? So one night, he was in play drums, he was playing with some youth, and I didn't have anything to do. So I, I, I drove over there, and at the end of the rehearsal, I asked him, if I'm big enough to play, you know, about 10 years, no, I'm touch that, you know, and they gave me a play. So the following morning, the following day, he saw me and he said to me, how oh, your sons up on your drums? I mean, I said, what you talking about? Because really, I didn't have a drum thing. <laughs> so, he said, where you start playing your drums? So, I mean, I can start annoying me. I'm a little school, you know, because I didn't have a drum thing. <laughs> anyway, he never ease up. He, 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 about a couple of days after, he brought a pair of stick, a practice pad, and a book. And he brought it to me and he said to me, say, hey, if you go back and play your drums, you know, wow. right this and all, I said, you know, myself still, you know, I said, I say, I eat that. <laughs> so, if you have peaceful life, we take them from him right. and we put them down in the house. Fast forward, a couple of months, they was in there like for a couple of months. I, I, I had a friend that came from, from um, Canada and I, I was by his house and we were playing some music and he played an album and he, he said to me that it was his, this was his favorite album and he played it back. I really rock well, you know, when I <laughs> realized that I listened to myself. I listened to yourself. Yeah, when the album nearly done the second time. A Burning Spear album and a Creation yeah. Rebel album. Nice, nice. And when I heard one of the songs and it catch me and trust me, frightened out of my wits. Rockwell, I remember them thing there. How far someone carried me. What was, it, what was it about it that clicked? Was it because why well, uh, you think about the fact that you did work on a Spear album? Uh, but, I, 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 there was no thought about about. I remember, you know, the album played the first time and it done and we had drink and Irie. And you know, at, at the second time when they played back, I think at the song where they say, Down by the river side. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, It's like they hear my drums and I say, My friend, my friend. When I got back my composure, I said to him, um, You know, me play them drums there. And I'm like him now to uh, believe me too, me should I hear from the first time. But you are no. You see, driving go on. You know, the whole of me out around them for me, you know, like, mm. like crazy that when I reach home, like, and this man come out of the yard, that all my mother start to ask me what to me. Mm. And I couldn't even tell her, me not tell her, I just said, no, man. It just, it the love, the passion just came back like yeah. that. Yeah, so I ended up in the back of my yard, and that's where I really started. You pick up the pad and the, the yeah, jump pad yeah. and yeah. After looking in it for weeks, you know, and then I saw what I did as Were I you still playing sound at that time? No. Me kind of sound. You know me that get bored on sound. Alright, don't move, don't move. <laughs> oh, yeah. 36 after the hour, watch your smile on his face. <laughs> <laughs> I feel it and I know my brain <laughs> I don't even, I can't even imagine what you feel. <laughs> 18 year old, them time they rap there. 18, 18, 19. You know what I say? Them time the promo does have them little naughty naughty at come at school. Them and them from Saint Paul, you know? Hey, and listen. And, and Spear is still at it. Spear retire and unretire the way the passion, we love it. It touch you. You remember? Yeah, man. No, man. No, man. Listen, John, listen. This is why so we have to sit down and talk with him. You know that Jamaica, but when I understand this, them says sometimes you see the glory, but you don't know the story. You know what I mean? Um, I know you in Linstead. 
All of the young youth there, but you say Sunday night? Yeah, Sunday night. Yeah, we do. Um, what was the mission behind this? Uh, you know, me and me say, all right. The first, all right, you know, we went down and we decided to say, I'm like to tell Peter Pona, we all say Peter Pona, Jamaica, this, you know, because you know, they, um, remember with the, me and Peter, the, um, we go on, uh, Anguilla, uh, Antigua with Glen Washington. And when the Antigua, I said to Sprang, say Sprang, you know, say, at last one, this man work with Anga, Jamaica, go take some broke pocket for a couple of years, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because. You knew that was part of it, eh? Yeah, yeah. and then that's when, I, uh, 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 after we came back, I uh, uh, put my things together and I went back home, you know. Because I know that from Jump Street, that was my mission, you know. Right. To leave, to come back. Yeah, because yeah. then, and then it's not like I, I can ask somebody what to do. I we have to do what I have to do. Right, I mean, live the life. You right, know, right, right, right. Yeah. So I, I admit a bass player, Colin Ellis, along the way. And during the time, like we in a, we in a rehearsal room, I went some, them call certain songs. It's like, a me animal won't know them, you know, hard you know. <laughs> so after a while, talking to him, you know, I realized that might be some of the dance them where me in a him, the Jack Ruby, the Emperor. Right, yeah, right, the, right. You know me, I said. Right, right. Yeah, it looked like him in I took him down the street. Eh. Right. Then talking to him again, realize that he must stop work for people and work for himself. Mm -hmm. And you know, he's not afraid of hardship just like myself, because we are doing to see it. Yeah, so the first project that that I did with him, 19, it was 19. 90. I met him during that time. Mm -hmm. It was the first song that I wrote and it represented Jamaica at the Caribbean Broadcasting Union Song Festival. Nice. And nice. after doing that now, um, I left for Mexico and then I came back and then we started recording some songs. What gave us the marker that we should continue doing what we were doing is the, the, the results that we were getting. Mm -hmm. After that song, which really surprised me, never see myself as a writer. And then being in a country and a life a full string. And you know, right. we're not hiding. You don't know the business run, man, friend and company, man. Yeah, yeah. And we have burned out that too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. But connections is good. It, it can it, but I know friend and company. Yeah, a connection. a connection. I let be you. respectful, yeah, bro. Yeah, true, true. You know what I say? Because friend and company keep our connection. Cool, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So we, the song being selected, and when we reached Jamaica School of Music, are they, are they, are they, they, it, was a, it was a Caribbean um, orchestra doing the event. Mm -hmm. But when we re reached the, the rehearsals, um, we were like, we, we, we had known for like two months, and I'd say, our song got selected to represent Jamaica. When we went there, we realized that the person who wrote the winning song just knew that two weeks before. So we were say, I said, BC, you know, she said, our song, take out and put on car, a revelation, you know, the man just knows two, three weeks, say, theme song will represent Jamaica. But you, we knew more than two months, JBC right. called us and, and told us. Nice. Yeah. yeah. And then fast forward, um, 95, we got two awards for a song. That was my farewell from Jamaica. Mm -hmm. And it was it was a song that we had recorded like from 91. And we see. And that year, I put the song in the festival 94. And that year, they never take it. A 10 song, them take. Watch me now. But us, right out the entrance, right out the day, photocopy. Sending back the same cassette, the same everything, nine to five. That year they took six songs, saying that the standard was, of the that was, was, the year. was, was going low. down. Yeah, and yeah. that was the year that they took. <laughs> <laughs> well, that means it was the best and the, and the, and the, and the lot. All right, so now <laughs> these are the markers where me and Bass always are. And I had to, I, I, you reminded me, I wanted to ask you. Because your label's name is Tabard Production. Tabard Production. Yeah. But on your Facebook page, it's not you alone. It's you and BC. And I said there must have been a reason 
why it was you alone. So the two owners start this thing, I did this thing. All right, the, when, when I met BSC, I was like way into production already, see? Right, right. But then with Cornerstone family. Which is, and what, what is that now? That's, that, the that, that's when, when, when the production, when, when, when the band came into be, to be, okay. when I met BSC. And, so the band is Cornerstone? Yeah, it, it's between me, BSC, and Peter Panda, Cornerstone family. Okay. Yeah. So Peter traveled hard for coming down to Jamaica. Yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, man. Um, big up Peter fan. Big up Peter fan. Every time, um, bro. So what's the connection between Tabat and Cornerstone? Is Cornerstone the right, Tabat, Tabat the label? All right, Tabat Production is a period company. Okay. You yeah. bring all of that, that you, bring all of, you bring all of your foreign business etiquette and knowledge. Yeah. Come on, Jamaica. No, you know, no, no, <laughs> you know, no. You know, Tabat Production was there. Before I who is Tabba? There's a there's a there's a reason for that story. That uh, name who, all right. Who is that? Is it that? Right, I'm telling you, being the only kid spell. <laughs> yeah. Me and my friend them used to take what my mother Bible dictionary and go bush with it. You see it? Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> so going through the Bible dictionary, um, I came up. I don't love push my name. You know, I don't really love put my face yeah. on my name. Up. Yeah. So. Uh, going through the Bible dictionary. This time, during this time, I was practicing my drums too. Right. Uh, I came up on the word Tabat Jana. Um, it means John. Okay. Uh, All right. But okay. it also means gift of life. Okay. And All the right. meaning of John also is gift, gift of, of life. All right. Cool. All and right. I figured more or less, not figure. Me no say. Music is a gift of life. Right, right, right. And so that just work. And yeah, it, it works. Yeah, it so, and then show me no one and put me the me up there. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, so we keep it simple. Yeah, all right, because I these are all the questions that, because you and I communicate fairly regular, but via WhatsApp and all of them stuff. And I know yeah. when Carlos doing, and I know when Tabot, but I said, here, I'm going to figure out the connection between the yeah. two. This is, this is now when I met BSA, and then, uh, you know, me and Bass was in Jamaica for years and there was, um, we tried hard to get a keyboard play around us. And, but because we weren't really, we never want to run up and down on the road, we just want production. But it's when me come up far now, and me come meet Peter Pan. And after working with Peter Pan a while, and me and him become very close, we started setting the pan here for me to do some production for myself, you not know, to have work for people and really. Mm -hmm. And me, I grown him, and then even, I guess so now me come learn the digital world around Zimra. Right. Yeah, because right. from Jamaica, that is one of the things where I know it would have taken a long time. Because right. the analog world. I am I am right there with you, Bridget. Yeah, and then. He now, come from final days. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> so now, you know, I'm a fatis now, I say, can you do this? Right. But then the urge for my drums, I had to do it, you know. Right, right. And I just say, all right, when I come and find me, I'll find some youth and I'll come learn this thing. Right, right. In, when, uh, the, when we were working at um, BSA and, and Peter Pan, Freddie McGregor, the Ian Sweetness, um, Little Green Apples there. Right, right. Yeah, and right. BSA and Peter Pan do it originally, you know, but they had um, redone basses, bass with I pass bass. So while we were at that studio, um, we started doing a, a lot of work for them. And they, and that was when they brought Zimra and all to um to start transferring from analog to digital. digital. And that's that yeah, Zimra been... came with the knowledge of the of the digital world, you know. And uh, 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 um because at the same little green apples, um one day I went to the studio and and Zimra saw me and realized that I made it. And he asked me, he said to me, Are you playing a song there? And I said, Yeah, man, and he said, What a little thing I'm going to do. Yeah, yeah. And I said, Yeah, like, I you don't say it's serious. I said, What am I doing? And he said, You think I don't know what I'm here. But then me and him become close along with poor man, Richie. Richie, and don't Emil. Do yeah, me. and at the circle that time, I learned the, the, the digital world in. You know, I said, yeah, choose Don't move, don't move, don't move. Oh, I wake up in the morning. I don't want to tell you. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I want to tell you. It can be, I give props where props is due. Me, I give props to you. One Saturday night, <laughs> we do a wedding, right? Wedding done, like, 
10 o'clock at least the MC part DJ take over now and the done now wasn't in the mood to hang around or come home um my, my ride come home and Tanta I have a Saturday night show and me here me get Tanto a rinse out that tune yeah. and me a call Tanto upon himself for and Tanto nah and so and Tanto rinse it about three and Tanto no usually play over tune for a hot one over and him a rinse out and so him a rinse the tune so me a call him because I want I want the tune and Tanto so after the Sunday we call me back and when him call me back me mix now you know when him call me back and my laugh <laughs> and me say me say what well, you know, so me I call you all night before the tune. He say, yeah, man, me know the tune. That's why me never answer. So oh, I wake up in the morning. He had sweetness, 12 minutes before the top of the hour. Down in my eyes. A little tune, your boy. I, she says hi. Then I stumbled to the breakfast table. And while the kids were going off to school, yeah, 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 yeah. goodbye. Smile and lips. No, 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 like how we did it slow. Right. The arrangement of the song. Right, right. Yeah, you have to get here on the credit for it. Because he make we arrange the song like this, that. This he asked true, us yeah. to do it like that. That is not true. Yeah, yeah so he gave um, him credit, you know. A couple of things that before we get out there, because we we'll have nine minutes, but we have a thing. I know you par with some up and coming artists in Jamaica. And you also par with some established artists mm -hmm. in Jamaica. Yeah. There's a thing going on right now. People are asked where Chronics say. They can't hear from Chronics. They can't see Chronics. And I know the Ibermar, that circle there, that group there, you, 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 you have some inside knowledge. Talk to me. Any word on him up in the hills like Lucy used to go up in the hills? You know, Ibermar just come home, you know, the other night, me and the studio, and him surprised me. And we had a good time. Yeah, but he was out in the deep for a minute, for a good while. Yeah. But he just come home, man. Nice. So, yeah, man. Nice. Iber, nice. Iber, Iber, man. Good. Dig up yourself, Iba. Because East Avenue again, you know, I tell you, East Avenue, Freddie McKay, Nana McLean, Soul Defenders used to be there, same way. Joseph Hill, as I used, uh, and next door, me used to live. You see me, so. Do you understand your place in this whole thing, regardless of how long you were at Studio One? Because stood, anything that comes through Studio One is part of Jamaica's musical history. Without, with, without that doubt, because a lot of those artists, it was either their first entry into a studio or their first hit out of, you know, out of a studio came through studio. And, and being a drum and see these, see these artists who to you was the man next door and the man down the street, <laughs> but to us, understand their place in, in Jamaica's musical history as a result your place in a Jamaican musical history. You 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 ever think about that? And I know you're not I know you're a very humble person. And that is why I've asked you. I ask you for two reasons. I ask you if you do know it and I ask you because how are you know say <laughs> if nobody know, if, if nobody know tell Reggie listen I don't know the old but the new artists but I have been blessed. Um Woony Studio and still and stuff to be introduced to a lot of like when I used to tell people, boy, you know, when Glenn bored, you know, Glenn run around the clubs and yeah, in little like. safe spaces just for vibe out sometime, just play the drums. And I'm like, really? Glenn Washington is can drum? Um people like even even um you know Ed Robinson when everybody with the tune knocking out of his door, but 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 Ed Spears is on a drum too. There's yeah, so yeah. many artists that we know for something else. Where their safe space is is drumming, 
and, and the conversion of R&B tunes to reggae tunes really come through the drum, drum butter. The same the, the thing that we recognize most of all is either the bass pattern or the drum pattern or for, or for R and the conversion for R and B to, to 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 reggae. Yeah. Do you understand where you sit in at this place, Reggie? All right. Now I'll tell you yes. So when we are asked for though, that being the youngest one, um oh, I'm very right. active you now from my generation. Yeah. Gotta crack me fall between, you know, the generation crack, you know. So you see, we have to build, we have to bridge. The generation, right, right. right? And big up lamb shade, you know. Yeah, bless up yourself. Yeah. <laughs> you have to explain Soul to rebel. Listen to me. Yeah. And may I ask hold you. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. May I forgive public props? I have yet to see a young lady that has marketed herself. No, no big money behind her faith has marketed herself and put her big up, big up Soul Rebel. She has, and, and, and you can say who Soul Rebel is to you. <laughs> yeah, she's my second child. Your second child. Yeah. And I tell you, she has worked to build a new firm. I'm going to ask you for the door before you close the program, you know. Because I'm going to converge them. You have to touch them, Sam, Linson Street. Peace, peace, peace. All right. So where we go, Linson Street. Yeah. Um, all right. So I'm going to ask you if you just give me the 30 second rundown. I'm going to run through it. Aizuri. Talk to me about Aizuri. Aizuri is the latest one that comes to the camp. All right. Good yard. And the juice man, too, you know, and keep it fresh and healthy, you okay. know. Okay. During right. the days of juices, you know. All right. And his track is called Violence in the Streets. Yeah. Jad screw and drum. Bass and bass. <laughs> what bass in him? Let me Peter with... Pan, Colin Ellis. Colin Ellis. And Dave. And Peter Pan, Pan Keys. Yeah. Who is our lead kids? You know, say, a, a, a pan player. Uh, 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 everything we hear, you right? So I'm sure you know. I'm sure you know. Nice. Yeah. Now the youths and men, but listen when me tell them, put the guns them down. Some don't listen, some don't listen, all them wanna break and gun them down. Yo, in the street full of each and to beat and repeat, and the youths them can't say, say you love it, don't be great. No for send them pull on them tough like concrete, now them throw down them rap up in our face, eh? I'm a weak can't sleep, all the blood pressure sticks here And they can wanna bury it in a deep In the community, no peace can't keep When the crocs and the sticks Boys of Missouri To me bitch Too much blood around in a hurt yeah. It's got violence in the street In a dirt car ah. People longing on to hook like a little piece Yeah, but the rhythm is out uh, Linston Street It's worse, ah uh. Tough to really know when I work out yeah. Inside the wake of a limb show And in a bird time It's true to Sir Rockwell Alright, talk to me about global now One car global, <laughs> the super bad one Yeah, you know Experience A who's out time, old school Big up yourself global You know him so like screechy that True that. Yeah, it's not like screechy that. Sometimes it's not like me right to them. Say, uh. Man, you work, 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 cause your flesh can't yeah, yeah. Man, you work, 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 I put some money in the bank. In the saving bank. Work, 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 to mind your kids and move man. Man, you work, 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 set up a phone. I read it down the street already. Yeah, man. All right. So I'll be getting lit. No, you not your, <laughs> no, you gotta earn it. Alright. <laughs> Easy, consistent, believe me. Me not gonna make me easy deceive me. Watch me, brother, sister, rook under the sun. Are we str struggling to keep one drop alive? Nah, man. It did it? It did it in the earth, bro, boy. No, man. listen, it, you know, I hear it. I hear people bawling all the time. Why? Reggae music done. It done. It, 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 it gone. Dance all right, I'll tell you, though. Now tell you, what. You see, a Jamaican around Jamaicans, you know, can I show you the effect of the one job? Me the Mozambique, you know, with um, born African and Okolo the Bay, Lucky the Bay, that I you know. And we did, we did um, sound check with Johnny. And after sound check, I went to the back of the bandstand and we did that chill. I see some people have come towards me, but I don't really appear in my mind. When I look up again, 
they came in front of me. One of the man come forward and he said, he said, you, 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 who are you? I know Slide on Bar and I know Cotton Barrett, but who are you? Who are you? <laughs> what I'm trying to say, I'll be here the sound. Yeah. The one job. Yeah. Yeah. You know, go on away. Because we're there, you know, praises be to the most high God. You see, man? Majority, and that's it. Majority, majority, quality majority. You know, oh, God, have mercy, yeah. it's called strong woman. And you know, right now, is a man from back then, or here, he really know, really right. theme. You know what I say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. you're so polite at that one. Is a man from back then? <laughs> <laughs> Yes. May I tell you why I'm in love, you girl? I'm you know, like, you Peter, we're getting ready to do his instrumental, so look out to the one the hard sprung, you see? Nice. The maestro. Nice. <laughs> Lieutenant Brooksy. Hey. Hey, no, no, don't tell me the man is in Iowa. And you know, say. Don't tell me the man in Iowa. You man. see him now. <laughs> uh, last week, he run up on the thing, you know. Cause I came up with, uh, on Tuesday and I was in the studio like doing this. Yeah. I was in the studio like until about one o'clock. And then what, what I sent you, I went to, uh, since I came up, I went to Lion Star Studio mm -hmm. and I finished it. And this is it. Yeah, yeah. Lieutenant Brooksy. And the links to the anthem this, yeah? Wait, them, you're rich? You're rich. Anthony. The young and the market on the hustle in a juggle in a lens in town. With the young and the market on the hustle in a juggle in a lens in town. We do that in the market with the rubber dump basket in the lens in town. We have artists fighting the dust and rubber dump to play upon the song. Welcome to the town calling instead of lessons in the parish of St. Catherine. Founded in the year 1509. By the Spaniards at the time As, as Developers. Someone who plays both sides I play outside and I guess we are a one man sound operator But I right. play out a live dance and thing now Here's my question to you As sweet as these songs are They end up in an early one They don't end up in a The middle of dance When dance from man You know something I say when did selectors stop leaving out them junior? The you advent, know, the it, advent of of it, it, of the the the, the laptop selectors. Mm. Preach the folder. Preach selectors. The seven. Preach. Uh, remember when you preach now. Anybody can be a selector. I, I, I love that. You know. uh, anybody can be. It grieves me. You know. Know. It grieves me. You know grieves me. me. Grieves me, brethren. Look here. You don't pay no price to be a laptop selector. You know. <sighs> But to be a, a vinyl selector, I'm to lift up them box there, you know. I'm Brock. Box, create a record. Yeah, man. Them but you just come say a selector and come plug up the thing, you don't know. Ta the thing, baby. Generic. Ta the thing. A <laughs> virgin said to me there, and I didn't put it this way. When there's a laptop selector teaching a laptop selector, they can't learn nothing. Eh? Then, okay, I'm blind, you blind, bro. <laughs> Ricochet. 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 Ricoch
we get this. I know we're running out of here, but we have John Screen in the studio. And you still have to talk about this Sunday night thing because it seems like it one, it's growing. Yeah, because you, you see all these artists though, um they came out of the Sunday nights. Mm, yeah, nice. all, all of them artists are very yeah. nice. Out nice. of Sunday night, oh, and then we develop a relationship. And there and then I got the opportunity to um, do the best I could for them. Because with the ear, all of the falls and the itches, night after night on the bandstand, you know what I say? <laughs> yeah, and these are the artists that we could have worked with who came along. Because it's not every artist that we produce, you know. <laughs> The ones yeah. you know are manager managers and producers. Yeah, man, and, and, then some, <laughs> and then some of the artists, them kind of bigger than we. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. yeah. But here what we're doing. At, at least so they think. No, but here what we're doing. We are using some smaller artists and we're going to make these artists bigger yeah, than man. them. Yeah, man. Yeah, so man. we are the small man. We're yeah, going to make some man bigger than them. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah. Cool, man. And it's a pleasure. And I'm, I'm so thankful. And for. The music world, the, the radio land listen to us. I want to say thank you all for being a part of us today and sharing this beautiful moment. Honestly, you know, I can't believe we know each other so long. And this is our first time we really, we always sit on a reason we we'll reach one on one, but on here in 20, how much years? years. At a time, right? Yeah, man, everybody. Can't hear, 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 it's, it's just a time. I hear you, Grinch. Yeah, we are, we are. And then, you know, it's from a seed to a tree, Rockwell. And, yeah. and you know what I, I respect big time? When you see the fruit, you know it, man. Because you know it. You see when we are planting. Yeah, you see, yeah, you see? Yeah, yeah. And to be here now, to to be this help, helpful to us, you know, we are so thankful. No, Because you hear the quality of the work. And you know, you, know, you surprise me too, you know. Because when you call me, you think that I'm Jamaica. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, and yeah, then they, they, when you say, Yeah, we have a company program, I say, Wait, yeah, man, what do you mean, Benji? No, <laughs> listen, listen, you know, we reach a stage in life that I don't know if, 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 if you were aware of the fight that I got in coming up in this business in a South Florida because where I started, a lot of the regular radio man used to burn fire for me because I don't hide it. Start on underground radio because there was a need. There was the mainstream radio wasn't playing. I remember, you know, when we play Warrior King and we play um, Bushman. Bushman was in the guy. When we play Bushman last night, um, first time I play Bushman, people call me and tell me, take that up, man, a copy Lucian, a fraud, and Ray Ray, and Tate. And they say, Warrior King, them was like, nah, the better than that, nah, nah, make it. I mean, Warrior King, I thought the other day, and it's about rapidly, I the first man to give me an interview on South Florida. And, and I am I am I have been blessed enough, you know, I talked to um uh Lord Fraser, Mr. Fraser the other day. I remember when Mr. Fraser used to come up here, I have been record them in 45 in a bag and walk from tech bus and walk from record store to rock sometime I drive on my pass and feel me say, where you going? He said, Why am I drop us a record at rainbow? We catch him down to Hollywood at Juicy with him bag a record. And I can still reach out to these artists. I can still reach out to these artists and say, boy, I beg your favor, I need this to them. Say, boy, Rockwell, I don't know nothing. You have it. Anytime I reach out to you, you always are send me the thing. See, I see a little thing on a video and say, yo, send me that. You always, I'm calling you always answer. I give thanks for that. I give thanks for your contribution to the business. And I give thanks for what you continue to contribute to the business. I'm glad to call your friend, Reggie. I'm glad for calling Reggie. Rockwell. I want to say thanks one more time. Yeah, you know what I say? Because it's all about us coming together yeah, and doing a better job. And you know, we want the people to know, say, 
I not just gonna fire in a Lindsay. <laughs> shut up. Say, musical shut up. Music, music, yeah, man. The robot of basket in a Lindsay. You see my nice so, I am looking for I've come down there later this year. I just tell the massive for line up because I come a studio. You understand me? Yeah, man. A Lindsay. Yeah, man. We have come half a pass through, man. We have half a pass through. Jack's love, 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 give love, thanks, love, love, love. Give thanks, 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 love. Give thanks,